the question is diamond's value is proportional to its weight square a piece of diamond broke and the weights of the broken pieces were in the ratio 1 is to 2 is to 3 is to 4 is to 5 the loss in value is rupees 85000 what is the value of the diamond twice the weight of the original diamond what is the value of the diamond twice the weight of the original diamond so this is a quantitative aptitude question on ratios and proportions so here what is talking about the diamond's value is proportional to its weight square see for the purpose of the explanation i am right now only explaining what is proportional to weight see let 1 kg of something let 1 kg of something be 1000 rupees let 1 kg of something be 1000 rupees so 2 kg because it is proportional 2 kg will become 2000 2 kg will become 2000 and 3 kg will become 3000 So pro, I am only talking about proportion to weight now. One kg is thousand means I have to multiply the same number two into one. Similarly three into one. So it will be one thousand, two thousand, and three thousand. This is a single piece. One kg block, two kg block, and three kg block. Supposing this three kg block is getting broken to three pieces of one kg. Supposing this three kg block is getting broken to three pieces of one kg each. The value which is three thousand will become three into one thousand, three thousand. The value which is three thousand will become three into one thousand. One three thousand. The value is not going to change because it is proportional to weight. Even if it is getting broken to hundreds of pieces, the value will remain the same. But the question is starting with proportional to weight square. This proportional to weight square. So I will have to convert this into square weight. So let this one kg become. I will have to convert this square weight. Let it become. What will become one square weight? The value let it remain the same thousand. Let it remain the same thousand. So two kg square weight will become four square weight. So a square will become four square weight, and because it is proportional to square weight, this will become four thousand. That is four into one thousand. One square into thousand means four square into four into thousand. Three kg will become nine square weight. This value will become nine thousand. That is nine into thousand will be nine thousand. Now supposing this three kg weight is getting broken to three pieces of one kg each, the value which is nine thousand will become three into one thousand. Because bigger the weight. The power square will be very big. Less than the weight square will be less. That is what is happening here. Three kg square weight is nine square weight. One kg square weight will be only one square weight. Three into one kg will be three square weight. The value will become nine thousand. Nine thousand will get reduced to three thousand, not nine thousand. Nine thousand will become reduced to three thousand. That is what is happening to our diamonds. Our diamond is getting broken into five pieces. The ratio one is to two is to three is to four is to five. So I just explain it for you to understand it. So it is getting broken to five pieces. Ratio one is to two is to three is to four is to five is to four is to five. Now, in case I want to find out the original weight, I'll have to introduce a constant factor. I'll have to introduce a constant factor. So I multiply this by x. Any ratio I have to multiply the same number to maintain the ratio. So I'll make it as x plus two x plus three x plus four x plus five x. So this is the original weight, which will be 15x. This is the original weight, which will be 15x. X plus 2x, 3x, 4x, 5x. 15x is the original weight. Because it is proportional to weight square, so I'll have to convert this into weight square. It will be 225x square. This will be 15x square will be 225x square. 15 times the whole square will be 225x square. Similarly, I'll have to find out the square root of the broken pieces. Similarly, I'll have to find out the square root of the broken pieces. So it will become x square. Plus 4x square, plus 9x square, plus 16x square, plus 25x square will be equal to 55x square. See, actually, I found out the original weight from the broken pieces, but when it comes to square weight, the original square weight was 225x square, whereas the combined square root of the broken pieces is only 55x square. So there is definitely loss in square weight. There is definitely loss in square weight, which will be 225x square minus 55x square. So there is loss in square root of 170x square. There is loss in square root of 170x square. They also given the loss in value because there is a loss in square root. There is loss in value. So 170x square, 170x square will be equal to 85,000. Value of 170x square is 84,000. So x square will be equal to 500. The value of 1x square is 500. Now the question is, what is the value of the diamond twice the weight of the original diamond? What is the value of the diamond twice the weight of the original diamond? See, original diamond is 15x. Original diamond is 15x. Twice the weight will be 30x. I'll have to convert this to square weight, which will be 900x square. 
So 30x square will be 9x square. If x square is equal to 500, 9x square will be equal to 900 into 500. This will be 4,50,000. The answer is 4,50,000. This is the way of doing it. Once you understand it, just like that, you can get 15 to 25 and 55. You can get your answer first. First is understand the question, knowing how to do it. Then probably you can do it by mind calculations. Subscribe to my channel. I will be adding questions every now and then. You can also register in my website. The same questions will be classified company-wise and uh, topic-wise. You can see it there. Wish you all the best.